Hey everyone, welcome to HD Power Saver, um, Battery Saver episode number 4. In this one I'll be showing you guys a little something with my screencasting software about how you can save battery life using the actual built-in Windows um, power management software. Basically what I'm going to show you is that you can change the Windows power options, how it actually uses power, it dims the screen automatically, turns down the CPU, the graphics off automatically. And it won't change the resolution of your screen, which I'll show you later. But it definitely is by far the easiest way to change the um, how much how long your computer can actually last on battery. So um, go ahead and watch the uh, software part, which is going to come up right after this, and that's it. So yeah, enjoy. All right, guys. Windows Power Options is a really, really, really simple and easy way to ch to change and tone down how much battery you're using if you're trying to max out your battery, which is what this whole video series is about. So what you're going to want to do, right here, I'm actually, I don't have my battery in right now, which is pretty intense. I, I just have it plugged in and it's um, it's running off the power. So I just left click on it once, and Windows Vista, you'll be able to select the power plan. I'm in high performance mode. Now if I were to take the cord out and just have battery, it's going to say this favors performance, but you will, you will be sacrificing quite a bit of battery life on this plan. Power saver is what your computer is, uh, balance is actually what your computer is set on by default. You're not getting the most performance out of your desktop replacement if you have it on balanced. So I, I leave mine on desk, on high replacement, on, sorry, high performance when mine's just sitting at my desk doing my work, playing games, etc. Power saver is the mode you want to put it in that will automatically dim your screen, turn down pretty much everything, tone down your CPU. And just let you do the core basics of what you're doing. Maybe listening to music, checking an email, just doing some basic Skype calls or whatever. So I leave mine on high performance mode. Now, if you're working with Windows XP, there is a quite different way to do this. First of all, you want to go to your control panel, which you can also find in the start menu. And in Windows XP, I'm remembering off the top of my head here. Let's wait for the control panel to open. Okay, I'm going to go to see here it should be under power options this will not work on a desktop a desktop automatically uses the max amount of power it's high performance mode, etc but because you're not trying to save battery but if you have a laptop you'll have a power options button double click on the power options button and there are your power plans you just set which one you want it'll even have a little dial here also since I bought an HP pavilion if I show additional plans there's an HP recommended plan which is kind of like the balance plan you see here so that is episode number four on power plans, how to um, save your battery. And hopefully you can watch this in HD so you can see everything clearly. And that is basically it. So if you have any other I hope you found that last tutorial helpful on your battery saving tips. This is my 8-cell laptop battery here. Basically what you're going to do is change the, uh, change the power saver options when you're in Windows Vista. If you have any other questions or you want me to do another tutorial, like I said, just leave a uh, subscribe to my page and... Uh, that button over there, or if you're watching in HD, it's down there. And subscribe to my page, send me a message, hit me up, I'll do whatever I can, and answer your question. So um, thanks for watching, and more episodes to come. Peace.